Hey, I'm KIC, and we are getting close, relatively speaking, to the Day 28 Org, but quite frankly, still quite a bit of time remaining. This is not as solidified as I hoped it would be, although I just did notice. That's interesting. I was not expecting to see that, so that must have been something I forgot a while back. Yeah, I was hoping this would be a little further along, that things would be cured. But that does not appear to be the case just yet. Now, I could probably start building on all of this and it would it'd be okay. It wouldn't be a big deal. But I think since it's not as far along as I thought it would be, I'm just going to have to call an audible right now. That's kind of not what I was planning on doing, but fine. So be it. We'll come back to that one at a later time. Instead... Let's go back to the workshop. And just like that, we're back at the workshop. What do we have going on over here? Just kind of thinking about it right quick. Oh, you guys are good to go. Oh, these guys are all good to go. Potatoes are not. So that means the coffee and one aloe will be ready. I think I'm going to wait. I'd rather them all be on the same time frame, so I'm just going to let the other ones sit there for a while and it'll be all right. We'll get everything unified on the same the same growing, harvesting, etc. cycle. And that'll be just a little easier to deal with, I think. You know, let's put all this stuff back. Oh, man. I should probably take this stuff and... I don't know. Do we have enough... Here, now we have enough stones. Let's just go ahead and make some more concrete mix just while I'm thinking about it. I just kind of noticed that we're technically running a little low on some of that stuff. This I'm going to repair, so we'll go ahead and repair you. Which, I know, maybe we shouldn't, but too late. I was just kind of looking at it from the standpoint of, well, you know. It's going to need to be repaired eventually. Oh man, all these other random things. Bandoliers reload 30% faster. Well, that sounds exciting. Let's take that. Triple storage pocket that increases carrying capacity. Hmm. Guess we can check that out right quick. I, I assume here, and I may be wrong. Oh, well, look at that. I guess you will go in there. Okay. Well, I mean, if it'll add damage, I'm not quite understanding what it's doing differently here. I don't know. Okay, whatever. I mean, I was really thinking that would be something that'd be better served on, like, an AK or something like that, but whatever. Military vest, can we repair this? I don't think we can repair it yet, because we don't have the requisite skill to do that. Where are, where are the military fibers? That's in this box. I just want to see if I can repair it. Okay, it will let me repair it, you know? I'm going to say whatever. That's, that's worth it, I think. That was only two fibers. I think that's fine. Wait a minute. Did you just put it back on? Okay, good. Now let's take it off. Oh. Shoot. Noise reduction or light armor rating. Alright. Light armor rating, you gotta go, because I want faster reloads. Can I, can I try that again? Thank you. Here we go close that. My goodness. Military boots. Let's see. We do have those guys. I think we bought these on the last one, right? If I'm not mistaken here, let's modify these. We will modify them. We'll take off those guys. Now, the problem here, I guess it's not a problem as much as it is a limitation. I was kind of hoping to put all these things on there, but I think we'll just go with those guys because those are more important to me than the additional armor. I mean... Really, if we get down to it, I could just take that off. Modify you. We'll put the additional armor plating on there. That gives us more armor. Boom, just like that. We're good. So this guy, we can go ahead and scrap those. And then we'll put that back on. Put that back on. And I think we're looking pretty good aside from the whole invisibility thing. Glad that continues to be an issue, though. Man, do we have any more? Let's see, those are all... High-level things, aren't they? Eesh. Not not high-level, though. That's not what I mean. Uh, I mean... Whatever I mean. 
Heavy armor. There we go. What does that take? Lots of stuff. Alright, I'm not going to worry about that right now, because we don't have a whole lot of military fibers just kicking around. Pistol, I think I'm going to just repair you. I realize I don't need to do it right now. Just going to do it. I prefer to have everything looking nice and clean and ready to go. That pickaxe is going to be fine. It's about to be nighttime. And then we can drop this stuff off over here. And, man, where are we on, on the whole glass project? So, business glass pane. If I wanted to make a few more of those, we can only do two because we're still limited on lead. So, where's the lead? I thought there was a bunch of lead in here. Did I put it in here to burn? No. I could have sworn I had a ton of lead in here. Where'd it go? Did I put it in the other one? Ah, oh, crud. Where'd you go, leads? Okay. Is it in here now? It sure is. All right. Let's... Let's add some lead to this guy. I don't even know here. Let's just... Let's just do this. We'll go half and half. I don't remember how much we need to make this... This stuff, but... Gonna be five a pop, and we need like I don't even know how many of them. Quite a few, if I remember right. And then we'll probably need some more glass in there, which means, unfortunately, I need to add some more crushed sand. Again, I keep wanting to save this stuff for making concrete, but then, like we were kind of saying the other day, maybe it doesn't matter. Oh, you need more time in here. I mean, we're finding concrete mix pretty much anywhere we go, so it's kind of like, I don't know, does it matter? Maybe it does, maybe it doesn't. It's kind of hard to say. You know, let's put that stuff in there. We'll put you in there. And that should add a fair amount of glass, right? Five a pop? Okay, good. We'll craft a few more of those, and then... Before I lose this stuff, because you know I will lose it. Just gonna happen. We'll put that in there. Where are we at with helmets, by the way? That's an armor rating of 8. How do you compare to something like that? An armor rating of 10. So we could probably flashlight mod that. Armor rating of 6. Interesting. So the military helmet is not as good as the SWAT helmet. Are you considered... Yeah, you're heavy armor. That's what I thought it would be. Interesting. So that guy... Is only six, but what do we have going on in here? Do we, we don't even have anything on this? How is it that the mining helmet is better? I guess because you can't mod it. I mean, I guess that makes sense. Oh my goodness. All right, well, it's fine. I think I might want to make some more flaming arrows, just because we are getting kind of close to the point of the horde. Might be fun to have a few more of these. So what do we need for them? Flaming arrows, gunpowder, tallow... Cloth and steel arrows. Do we have gunpowder? Look at that. It's a little dark in here. Let me, um... Did I break? There it goes. I say I'm hitting the button, but it's not doing it. You know, let's just make some more of those. That'll be fine. That'll get us rolling for a little while. Business glass panes. I don't even honestly know how many we need. I'm going to say 20 is probably sufficient. If I had to guess. Here, we'll just go ahead and... Spread that out so that goes down twice as quickly. Those guys can go in there. We're going to need some more steel arrows, so I'll just grab those. Where are we on the steel arrow front? We should probably... Well, I guess I don't need those right this second. We should probably make some additional arrowheads. So I'll just get those started. And I don't necessarily want to do a bunch of them, because I'm still trying to mostly use this stuff. Wow, that's going to be 500. Ouch. I'm still mostly trying to use that metal for steel, which I realized I used some steel earlier to repair things, but again, just not going to sweat it right now. Oh man, I was kind of hoping... Here, let's take a couple of these guys, and we'll throw, we'll throw our two crappiest ones in there. And then there we go, and that should give a pretty good chunk of metal. I don't think it'll be a huge chunk. But it'll be decent. 
Okay, so this will give us, what, about 60 of these guys by the time we're done? I might not end up using those for the horde, but... I think it would be good to have them just the same. Here, let's grab... Let's grab all this stuff. We're going to head over to... The... I, I guess I'm going to call it the base. I don't know. I don't know what to call it anymore. Let's grab the land claim block. We haven't really put that in place just yet, so maybe we should do that. And then I think we have everything we need. We have a nail gun because I was intending to work on the horde defense base, but minor details and all. I need to get up here too so I can evaluate. Let's see. I mean, I think I'm okay with the way this looks like, the way I did those, those inside blocks. I'm okay with that. I don't love it, but I think the effect I'm going for Oh, shoot. Maybe that is better. The problem is I don't like how it looks up top. That is better, though. From the outside, that is definitely a better look. Oh, dang it. Let me see what I can do on the roof to, to make it look a little better on the roof. Here, let's go up this way. Gotta remember that I have ladders and things everywhere. I mean, I guess that's no different than what I have going on right here, is it? It really isn't. Okay. You win. So that one we're going to leave. This one is going to go away. Which means we need to make some more of those filler blocks. Filler? Corner filler. Let's do uh, one, two, three of these, I guess. Because we already have some down there. I already have one down there. Whatever. Let's uh, rotate you around. That is a better look. I gotta admit, from the outside, that is... That really, truly is a better look. I was thinking for some reason that up here I didn't have these... These hard angles on the backside of stuff, but no, I do. It's okay, I mean, whatever. I think it's fine. I mean, if I wanted to really change things, then I have to kind of change... Let me go downstairs for just a moment. I have to change construction on a bunch of other stuff. See, like this whole block right here, that. Uh, yeah. I don't, I don't really want to do that. I'm okay with those weird, funky gaps. I'm not going to worry about it. It's just... It's not worth worrying about. You know what I mean? Let's grab our glass panes, which apparently it is sturdy enough that I can walk around on it, so that's nice. Here, can we... Am I too far away to be targeting that? I think that's what's happening here. Let me put one of these guys down and... No? Alright. Is that correct now? I think it is. Ah, uh, shoot, I'm having... I'm having a hard time telling again. I'm gonna... I don't think you're right. You look like you're on the wrong face. That just doesn't look right to me. Yeah, see? Here, this was this was my kind of secret, was to do it that way. That and apparently 17.2 brought that back to make it easier to place. Oh man, I can't hit those corner spots. That's going to be a problem. Wait a minute, how did I do this before then? What did I do, Cat? Did I place them from the other side? Maybe I did. That would kind of make sense. I don't know. Is that what I did? I think maybe that's what I did, is I placed them from this side, because otherwise... I can't target some of these spots. And there will be a slight difference if this is not what I did. I don't see a difference, so I'm going to say that's how I did it. It's been too long, kitty. It's been too long. I'll go ahead and just pop these guys into place here. This is going to look nice when this is done. And then we'll upgrade the rest of this stuff here momentarily. Now this is going to be interesting. Let's see, I gotta make sure my targeting is correct, because this is going to be very easy for me to screw up right here. Look at that, I think that's the entire... 
That's the entire thing right there. Nice. Good work, kitty. Here, let's go ahead and put these guys down a little more permanently. At some point, I do want to come back and do some work on the base and maybe paint it. I mean, I think I'd like to also just reinforce everything, but for right now, this is totally okay with me. Those little gable pieces, those are fine. I like them. I mean, again, I'm kind of at the point where I could redo some of these blocks right here. Like, I could do maybe those corner fillers over here. I don't know. Do I have any spare gable pieces? I think I do. Here, I have that gable quarter. So, let me just see what happens if I do this. We'll put that one in place right here. Just out of curiosity. But then, see, that would require redoing this block right here, which, you know, whatever. I got cobblestones for days. So then we'll grab another one of these. And do something like that. I don't know. That might be an improvement. Ah, yeah, see, I kind of liked the the staggered look, though. And that just gives everything a uniformity that... I mean, I don't know. Maybe I'll just go with that. I, I kind of like the... the weird toothy look, but then... I kind of like that uniformity, too. I think we'll go uniformity. I wasn't going to really was not interested in making everything look the same right there, but ah, that's all right. Although then, what do I do with these spots right here, right? Hmm. Well, I'll worry about that later. Uh, the thing is, I'm not really planning on spending any time up on the roof. Not realistically, so it's kind of like, eh, I don't know if it matters. So then we need to get rid of this piece right here, right? And we'll go ahead and get that started so that by the time we're ready to place them, they are ready to go. So one right there. One right there. And then one more time, I just want to take a look. I realize it's going to look the exact same as the other side, but sometimes it's useful to get a look at the entire thing. So that basically looks the same as when we go to the side over here. I mean, it's not quite the same because there's a little bit more space in here. There's a block in the middle, which is leaving space for something over here. And I don't know what that is. Might be a blade trap. It might just be a tree, which I realize you can't plant the tree right there. But minor details aside, I think I'm okay with all this stuff. This is this is fine. Should probably put some doors in here. So why don't we go ahead and... Oh, what kind of door options do we have? Still just those. Eh. That's fine. We'll we'll put some doors up in the place. I mean, we're we're getting along here. I mean, things are are moving in the right direction. Put a door right there. Door goes right there. Door goes right there, and then we're gonna need one more here, so one more door. One more doer. And then that one goes right there. Look at that. Although that's really awkward. Eh, whatever. Oh, I need one more over here, too. I really was not at all paying attention to the uh, location of the doors. So if I put that one there, then that opens just the exact same way. Perfect. Makes no sense. Yeah, see that? That's much better. I should have flipped those things around, but whatever. I matched those two so that they open the same way. So I'm going to say it's fine. I'll probably break them and replace them later because I don't like that. That's kind of weird. Yeah, it's just obnoxious. All right, I, I can't abide that. I mean, easy come, easy go, right? So then, here, let me go back to this, go back to that one. So that needs to be... Oh, I never...
never know which way it's going to go. I mean, I want to be able to open it up before I pop it in place. Say that should be the right way. And then that should be the right way. Okay, good. Phew. I'm not completely useless at this game. So we need to add the land claim block. I want to do that... I don't know, maybe in the bedroom or something. So we're going to do it like this. We're going to just chomp that block out. Chomp that block out. Chomp that block out. Chomp that block out. And then we're going to put this guy... Right there. And we get the sound of drums. Nice tribal effect. And that's probably a terrible place, because if I remember right, the land claim blocks expire. So I'll need to remember land claim block is in that corner. Ah, uh, cat. Don't let me forget that's where it's at. Oh, boy. All sorts of other things we can do in here. Can we make a stove oven? Stove... Nope. All right, those are probably things that we can buy still. Suppose we should make a bed over here rather than this thing. So what does it take to make a bed? An old bed, a king-size bed. So we need some cloth, some cotton, some springs, and some pipes. All right, so I don't know if we have enough cotton on hand. Because we need actual cotton, not, not cloth fragments. So let's see if we can take care of that. I really have no idea how many we have. I thought I heard a zombie there. Not to be. Good. Would hate to get some additional experience right now. That'd be awful. Would like to make sure that I don't level up and that I don't get access to all the cool things that come much later in the game. Perfect. Works for me. A lot of cotton plants nearby. That is handy. That is one good thing about being in the forest, is that nice, good chunk of various resources. Not all just the same stuff. Lots of chrysanthemum. Look at this. A whole bunch of them over here. Holy cow. Here, we'll just go ahead and take some, because I think we can probably stand to make a little more tea, if nothing else. Punchin', 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 punchin' plants all day long. I really do want the Weed Whacker. Just hold the button down and zoom through here. All right, let's say that's good enough with that one. I think that will be enough. I didn't see how long it's going to take to make the bed, but I assume a little while. And we'll go ahead and take those, too. Gonna need to eat some food. Get stamina back up. I didn't even see, where are we at? Level 93. So we're pretty close to some important stuff. Not quite there yet. I might, at the rate this is going, I might just have to bypass the truck and go straight to Gyrocopter. I mean, the whole reason for the truck is that you can just, I don't know, put a crap ton of stuff in it, but if I don't have a crap ton of stuff to put in it, who really cares? Can we not make, like, dressers and other stuff? What can we make in here? We can do... the sofas and all that jazz. I wouldn't mind a sofa chair. That might be kind of nice. I suppose we can make some benches and sell them for gobs of money. I don't think I want to do that. Let's maybe do that, though. Here, let's grab some nails and some leather. So, nails and leather. And we'll make a leather sofa chair, and then we'll make the larger sofa, too. That'll be nice. Old couches, meh. Meh. Is all this stuff really done in here? Wow, okay. I didn't realize how much stuff you need, or you can make by way of this thing. Alright, whatever. Table saws, exciting stuff. So we'll take that, and then... I 
guess we should do a little wood table. That would probably be a good idea. We'll add that to the list of stuff. And then... I kind of like the idea of the barrel set. That's, that's nice. Maybe we'll do something along those lines. I think that's a good look. Some wooden chairs. I mean, I guess we could probably just snag some chairs out of a POI. I mean, I tend to do that fairly regularly as is. So here we'll put the springs, all that jazz back. Then let's head back over to the house. Base, whatever this is. Man, it's going to be brutal when it comes time to clean up this yard. So that I can put a big fence around it. Oof. I'm not looking forward to that. I mean, if it was that bad to just punch a handful of plants. Yikes. So we'll pick that guy up and then... Presumably, this will count as an actual thing. I don't know, as as a as a bed thingy, majigger. There we go. Perfect. And maybe we'll just put the the chair in the corner here. I like the look of that. That's nice. And then we'll go out to the. I don't know. I guess this is kind of a living space. It kind of, sort of is. I don't know. Whatever. I'm gonna put the sofa. Up against the wall over here, maybe? And it kind of sticks out there. I don't know if I'm a big fan of that. Guess we could do it on that side. That's not bad. I like that. That, that works for me. And then... kind of think I want to have a little table in here. Can I make... Can I still make cabinets? Cupboards and cabinets? Okay, that's good. Oh, interesting. The cabinets require cobblestone. And they require cupboards. Okay, well, let's do, uh, I don't know, we'll say 10 of those guys, because then we can turn some of them into cabinets. And I don't know where to put this, so you know what? I'm going to pass on that for right now. I think instead what I want to do is maybe make some more wooden frames. I'm going to use the frames as, once again, my way to kind of figure out where stuff goes. Probably need some more wood frame ramps, ramp frames... That sort of jazz. And I'll use those to figure out where stuff goes. And we'll worry about that one on the next one. Because we have hit morning and it is time to call it a day. So I'll catch you on the next one. Till then, thanks for watching. See you later.